continuing with the business letters uh, next in line is the letter of order now this letter of order why it is written the letter of order is written to order services or products the format is similar to any formal letter but the language used should be formal now there are certain things that you should remember identify yourself clearly state the purpose of writing to be brief and to the point be positive and polite now while ordering something the important points to be remembered are the items to be ordered specify quantity how much you require quality or brand what should be the quality of the product or what should be the brand etc all these things then mention terms and conditions and these terms and conditions may be the date of delivery payment discount etc so that is again the revision of the same points comes in the category of formal letter format is that of a formal letter divided into minimum 3 paragraphs that is very important now this is the layout if you look at the layout it is if you 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 will be able to see that it has the same layout of that of a formal letter sender's address date receiver's address subject now again uh, a reminder that subject should be always underlined then salutation now the whole body that is divided into three paragraphs para 1 states clearly what is the purpose of writing here you can also mention the reference of any previous letter or previous communication that you had uh, with the dealer or something like that now para 2 here you give the details of the order placed and it is also always preferred that it should be in the tabular form and para 3 that is the concluding paragraph that is that states terms and condition of delivery payment discount etc and then finally it is the subscription now here's the question you are ashok kumar sports secretary of abc public school varanasi place an order with messer star sports store varanasi for various sports item <clears throat> now you will see that there is no designation mentioned over here it is just the name of the store now in that case always remember that you never write to a store you write to a person in that store so whenever you are writing the receiver's address some designation has to be mentioned over there so in this case when we see the example it will be more clear to you now you see here the sender address then the date now here you see i have given a designation the manager so generally what the mistake is done if there is no designation mentioned in the question people generally start with the name of the store or something like that but then remember there should be always a designation because a letter is written always to a person not to a building okay so the manager messer star sports store varanasi subject order for supply of sports item now here you again see the subject line is underlined sir this letter is with reference to the quotation sent by you for the supply of sports items we have gone through it and would like to place an order with you please supply the following now here you see this is the second paragraph where we are specifying the things that we are going to order now look at the way it has been presented over here in the tabular form serial number item brand and then quantity uh, number 1 hockey sticks brand zenith 15 dozen hockey balls omega 20 dozen football omega 10 dozen basketball superior 15 dozen so here it can be either quality or brand name specified going to the third paragraph please supply the above mentioned sports items by 30th april you have to mention a date you have to mention a date by which the uh, item should be uh, delivered please take care of specifications and packaging any unspecified or damaged item will not be accepted that is that comes into the terms and condition payment will be done through check 3 days after delivery subject to the satisfaction of the sports committee I hope you will consider 20% discount you usually give on bulk orders. 
so these are the various terms in this in this paragraph we see <coughs> we have mentioned the terms and condition which we have set for the supply of the things and then comes the subscription thanking you yours truly ashok kumar sports secretary so this was the letter of order as the part of business letter